Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. Today I've got another episode of What's New? What's new? We're at Togo's. It's my local sandwich shop. They've got a couple of locations throughout Northern California. And this is this was originally way back in like the 80s. They've brought it back. I think it's a limited time. It is new. Well, let's do them. I used to get these all the time. And this is, uh, they've dubbed it the number 40, the barbecue beef sandwich. And I went for the large. It was 14, 14.25 for the large. And it is tons of barbecue beef in their tangy Memphis barbecue sauce onions and pickles and that's it and it's nicely toasted on your choice of roll they wanted sourdough but i actually just got white and i'm gonna go ahead and pull open that one and give you a profile of the half so yes it's got the memphis barbecue sauce and that uh, beef in there and uh, I think I might be able to show you some pickles and onions are in there. You could actually add things to it. You could add like lettuce, tomatoes, uh, pepperoncinis, whatever you want. I just went with what it comes with um, when you kind of pile it up and after you've had it uh, heated and, and melted. This could probably go good with some Swiss or uh, a provolone and have it melted on, but as a traditional barbecue beef sandwich. I'm gonna give it a try and see how good that Memphis barbecue sauce is. It's supposed to be very tangy. And you had the option to go light or heavy. I just went as regular and I'm gonna give it a try for you guys here. So here we go guys. The brand new Memphis barbecue beef sandwich returning to Togo's after a very long absence. So here we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. Certainly lots of sauce. Pickles, I can taste in there now. Those onions as well. But you can see all that barbecue sauce in there. Very nice and tangy. The bun's a little crispy because they did toast it. But that's like that pulled pork that you usually get. But this is barbecue beef, so it's actually nicely done. It's their roast beef, so roasted, and they've added it into their tangy barbecue sauce. And you can see that right there. A little bit of that. And then also grilled onions. Actually, that is fairly good. I like that. Yeah. Very simple. Pickles and onions and barbecue sauce. That's it. You want don't want to get too complicated. You don't want to bog it down with onions and lettuce. Pepperoncinis might have gone okay. Or jalapenos. You could actually add those if you really wanted to. But uh, trying it as it is, it's actually really good. And with lots of barbecue sauce. And the roast beef is... is quite well done quite tasty all in all very satisfying sandwich so if you do have a togo's in the area give it a try they also have killer pastrami um roast beef all kinds of other sandwiches so for that one the brand new barbecue beef sandwich over at togo's i'm gonna give that one a 10 a 10 out of 11 It's good. The roast beef is good. The Memphis barbecue sauce is certainly tangy. Uh, it's just not outstanding. Not uh, one over their very best. It is very good. For a barbecue beef sandwich that I haven't had for probably uh, about 30 or 40 years, uh, it does kind of hit the spot, hits the craving. 
people were probably asking them, bring it back, bring it back, bring back the barbecue beef. They did. Like I said, I'm glad I got to try it. Glad I got to check it off my bucket list. So if you do have a Togo's in your area, make sure you get down there and try one of their sandwiches or salads or uh, other items as well. So there you go, guys. That's what's new over at Togo's. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over here. That way you won't miss any future content. Or if I go live, you won't miss the fun. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be trying something new and barbecue beef for you, definitely we'll finish this off and probably get another one before they uh, go away. So until next time, guys, talk to you later.